I just been all on my grind, I ain't had no time to waste. You must be out of your mind, me, I've been all in my safe. I need some time to unwind, all of this stuff on my brain. I'm trying to have a good time, it's been all work and no play. Oh, hey. Boy, you said something. Boy, you said something. Boy, you said hey, something. Boy, you said something. Boy, you said something. Hey, boy, you said something. Boy, you said something. Hey, boy, you said something. Boy, hey, you so crazy. Okay, now we back, and we apologize for the delay. Yeah. Difficulties. There we go. Difficulties. We good now? I think we good. We good. We good. We good. Hey, we're going to welcome Raymond G to the show again. Yeah, let's take two. Take two. <laughs> we ready now, though. We ready. We apologize yeah. for Hey, look, days. since we messed it up before, we're going to have to do it again. Well, you know, we're going we're gonna to get this. This we're is gonna start another off shot. Right. Yeah. Number two? Number two. Oh, that's my first one. Just FYI. Big lie. Welcome to the show. Let's again. go. Let's have a good one, man. Appreciate it. Yes, sir. Why that would hit oh. a little bit different. That would hit what was different. that different? Yeah, it definitely was different. Ugh. Cause it warm. That's all. It was. <laughs> <laughs> so G, welcome to the show. Welcome man. to the show, big dog. Hold man, on, wait, you should come. Hold on, wait. You alright? Good. You sure? I'm good, man. Alright. Alright, all right, hey, let's hey, go. We, hey, we prank over here. Hey man. Hey. See. This ain't no water. This boy been an alcoholic. Boy. Uh G, tell us who you are, where you're from. Um Tell us a little bit about yourself, man. All right, um, I'm Raymond from 158 Reesville, North Carolina. 158. By way of what now? By way of what? Reesville. No, no uh, by way of where you know, he By way of Reesville. But uh, yeah, 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 wait, you right. Yeah. You, you, you right. Yeah, I, I, I did. I did. I, yeah, I definitely you did. You was right. Don't worry about but that. You, but you currently live I, where? I currently live in Greenville, North Carolina. Gotcha. And your social security number is what? <laughs> so scared. <laughs> oh man. Your residence. You say again. What? Yeah, I graduated from Reasonable High, two thousand one. No, class of one. One, and That's I've been class. in Greenville since two thousand one. Nice, nice. So, so we got you on the show, Raymond. We want to talk a little bit about your artistry, your artwork, your paintings, your drawings. Um, you know, I know personally that you've been drawing and painting for a long time, which I didn't know. Yeah. At all, and you stayed like right down the street from me. Indeed. You know what I'm saying? So I, all these years, I had no clue. And, right. it's, been, and it's pretty dope for so sure. So we're going to dive into oh, it, man. Tell, tell us a little bit, like, how you got? How did you get started painting or drawing, both? Um, how I got started, um, my mom owned her own bridal business. Um, she bought me one of those art project kit things you buy back in the day. And I pretty much taught myself how to draw when I was around, like, six or seven years old. Just so, playing around with it? Yep, just playing around, wow. just drawing stuff I would see around her shop. Cause she she owned her own business at the time, so I didn't see how powerful that was back in the day. That was like in the '90s. She had her own business, if I yeah. own. I'm like, right. you know, looking back at it now. That was that was pretty dope. Um, just to see her, you know, owning her own business back in the day in the '90s. So. Hold on, hold on. Some, somebody, somebody, Sam. Some, uh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. So. um Back in the nineties, just seeing her own her own shop, you know, black owned, it was that was pretty dope. Yeah. But um, that's pretty much how I kind of like got into it, um, painting and drawing when I was around like six or seven years old. Hey, we got to one mic. Hey, they don't want to be free. Yeah, they don't. They don't but we gonna make it. it. Yeah. Somebody shake, shake. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! I, I don't know what I don't know what's going on. Right now. Everybody right. sit still. <laughs> so, <laughs> Let's do the mannequin challenge. Right. <laughs> Let's do the mannequin challenge. Talk like this. <laughs> no, but I, I didn't move. It's just the mic, bro. I mean the cold work. That's what it is. Oh, we, just we, go, we ain't gonna restart this. But we gonna have, we gonna have to maybe, maybe y'all share one. Me and, my, me and Jamal share one. So we keep it going. It's mine? Just thought I was sick. Wait, 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 wait. Boom. For sure. Okay. For sure it was yours. Here we go. For sure it was yours. Okay, here we go. Yeah. I, I never moved. Things they the same way. <laughs> <laughs> I got this. 
<laughs> all right, we good. No we big good. deal. We all right. Yeah. All right, Sorry bro. about that. So, so yeah, like, so back in the 90s, about being how powerful it was to see, uh, see your mother, number one, a black-owned business, you know, that, that probably wasn't, uh, that wasn't, that was rare. Like, that wasn't something we saw on a regular basis. Right. Um, I remember, like, one of the businesses that I remember in our community, black-owned, was JoJo Javon. That, that's just one that come to mind. I remember when JoJo Javon opened up his, like, his uh, store. Yeah. And you could get beepers, I mean, pagers, yeah, you could get CDs. CDs, you can get, like, clothing. Yeah. And, but it was, the, it was a place for us to go and relate yeah. to. Yeah, yeah. And it was black-owned, and that was something that was huge. And not at the time, we didn't even know. It was just a place, it was just a, a was. local place for us. Yeah, yeah. Versus going to the borough. Yeah, you had your agreement. Yeah, 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 no Get doubt. Cussing CDs. Oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The bootleg CDs. Yeah, no doubt. So, oh. so pretty much, you, you, you literally taught yourself. No, 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 hold on, hold on. I don't mean to cut y'all off. Still had House of Wax, though. They were before Joe's Vaughn. Yeah, 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 that's true. That's, that's very true. true. That's, that's, that's like 40 years, right? Yeah, that's, yeah. That's, they, they was there for a Yeah, minute. that's true. They, yeah. they was up there. Yeah. I, but see, as a teenager, Joe Vaughn was my years. House yeah. of Wax was before that. Yeah. Yeah. Where I wasn't. They still kind of kept Well, well House yeah. of Wax is still their now. Is it really? Is it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, that's I got a Wu-Tang CD from there. I just didn't, I, I didn't have no, I, I, at that age, I just didn't, I didn't really know how big it was, and it wasn't an outlet for me, like, to go It was a life for our parents, that Yeah, you know, yeah, for sure, yeah. for sure. Um, but, like, getting back to you learning, your, teaching yourself how to draw and, and paint, like, you didn't ever look at, like, any, did you, like, like, tracer books, or was there, like, other materials that maybe your parents bought you that you kind of looked into, or? No. no we, um, just, just, <laughs> see, I was, I was a tracer. No. So, I was so, good, I was so good at tracing. <laughs> I was a fraud, like a, my boy. That's how I learned. Boy, though. I was a fraud. <laughs> By the time I got to the eighth grade, I could draw decent. Mm -hmm. I messed up lying. No, I could, I could draw. No, man, man you lying. Yeah, now you're all, yeah. basketball <laughs> player, <laughs> artist, <laughs> singer, rapper, he everything, man. I never seen him draw. <laughs> Because you know why, you know why, Raymond? Because he damn lying. Yeah. Don't be mad at me. <laughs> That's what Don't be mad at me because I'm a bow tie talent. Yeah. <laughs> you know, what guess we got on prayer this yeah. year? Yeah, I play a little baseball. Oh, I play yeah. red. Well, I, I can do a little bit of everything. Man, you ain't did hey, shit. But I had to see it. Hey, just dribble. I, <laughs> yeah, shut up and just dribble, man. <laughs> first, 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 Black History Month. <laughs> oh, it's, 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 it's almost over. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you got another day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got another. You got. You got. Right. You got twenty-four more hours. Hey, right. 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 we squeeze in just in time. Just in time. Just, just in, in time. time. Which we gonna get into. I know. I know. Um. So, so what type of like what type of paintings and 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 drawings? Like right now, what's your favorite? Do you like to sketch or is it painting? I'm more um, geared towards. Um, painting right now. Right, okay. Um, just using the different colors and just showing those different, um, to attach to different people. Because mm -hmm. um, one person can see <laughs> our artwork and say, I see this, and another person say, I feel this emotion out of one of my paintings. So, yeah, okay. You know, it varies depending on what you see inside of my paintings. What type of artist are you, like an abstract? I was going to ask, what, is, yeah. what does that mean? What does abstract uh, drawing mean? What is that? I was going to ask. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that, the abstract is pretty much, um, I would say just, it's more, I would say more abstract, it's just like, it's more colors, and you may get lost in kind of the colors and the background scenery, course, but yeah. um, of course, sometimes you, you could combine abstract with, um, um, gosh, losing the track of words. Shot, shot, <laughs> shot, 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 the Ciroc on his head. With, um, the Ciroc is on his head. With, with, paint, he already know what kind of feeling he <laughs> With realistic, realistic painting. Yeah, so okay, you, can okay. combine, you can combine the two. So the okay. background could be abstract. And then in the foreground, it could be um, something that's very, very, you know, realistic. Now, you don't change it foreground. What's foreground? Man? <laughs> you mean in front? Uh, yeah, yeah. Is that what you mean? <laughs> so you have, so you have, you have the background, the What's background, that? and then the foreground. So okay. you have the three different stages. So, I didn't know that. I yeah. didn't know that. Okay. So, you know, it's kind of like using those kind of like perspectives. So, like, it's kind of like if you want to bring someone into your artwork. Yeah. Okay. Um, especially in an art gallery. So if you're walking by a piece and you know... It draws you in, mm -hmm. using okay. those colors, and using that perspective to kind of like, okay, it's drawing me into, you know. No doubt. That's pretty dope. Painting, so. Now, all the stuff that you learn on your own, do you go to school for this? Or yes, what? Um, I graduated from ECU in 2006. I was an art major. Okay. Um, well, going back to middle school, um, I took all art classes. I was under... Her name was Miss Amos. And yeah, that's exactly right. Yeah. That's exactly yeah. right, Miss Amos. Yeah, yeah. Miss Amos in middle school. Um, high school was Mr. Weiner. 
Mm-hmm. I don't know if he's still there or not. But um, the crazy thing about Mr. Weiner, he he put one of my pieces into an art show. I did not know he was going to put it in. And he ended up winning um, in the art show. So I got first place. And then he was like, well, you need to focus on going to college. Well, how much money a, you get? Being an art major. I'm about to say, say that. <laughs> <laughs> did he keep the winnings? Well, or? Well, what did, you, did you win anything? Yeah. Well, did you, oh, just first place. You get a ribbon. Yeah. I did get a ribbon, but okay. I don't remember any cash. So, you know. <laughs> oh, oh, Mr. A out of the B somewhere still living off that man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, we don't, want, we don't want to bring that Boy, up. Boy, is that not how they do it? No, my no. Boy, no, my no. Oh, my no, no. That's, that's not good. Boy, got a ribbon for the roses earlier. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this, is a little, this is a little off the topic, and I'm just asking it because I see it in the movies all the time. But have you ever uh, used painting, like doing intercourse? <laughs> wait a minute, hold on. Hold on. Uh, hold on, wait. Hold the fuck on. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, shit. Hold on, say. <laughs> like, you know, I, just, hey. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to figure out. Explain yourself, because. <laughs> the man, you might love paint so much that you might be painting with your lady or something, and y'all kind of get into it, and y'all be. Like a sipping paint, and then it's turned to sex. No, nah, not just sipping paint. You actually. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know. I was just asking. Hey. So have you done it? Hell. <laughs> No, I haven't. Oh. But um, I don't know if you're talking about, about like painting? figurative drawing. Like yeah. if a girl posed for you nude. Body paint. I wasn't talking you, about that. I was going to get into that, but I wasn't talking about No, like, well, what the hell was you talking yeah, about, yeah, about yeah. then? I don't know what you're just, talking you, about. Just, you just have me be, you may be just into it. Yeah, so y'all. Painting fuck. So, so, he, did, so he, just, he just in the, in the bedroom painting naked. Painting the fuck. I paint with clothes on. Okay, cool. Good to know. No tape. Do, okay, do, 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 do you do body painting? Do you do body painting? I'm still confused. I, mean, I, am. I am too. I don't think I word the question right. But oh, okay. I just you in it, yeah, it might be the Ciroc Yeah, I'm just saying. Have y'all not seen movies where? No, nah, we ain't seen no fucking movies where it did it. I can't remember. I know I've seen movies, but people. All I know is ghosts. Ghosts we do the. the she made. She's making faces. Right. What the fuck? Do you do body painting? That ain't what the fuck you asked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not what you asked. It's a different you question. question. <laughs> yeah. It's a different question. Do you do body paint, though? No, yeah. I don't. I don't. I have, I have not done anything. Have you ever tried? Look, look. We cannot let this man skate. I have not. Oh, have that not. question right there. I might have screwed the yeah, question, though. Yeah, yeah. I, I have not. Have you and your old lady... What was the question? Have you and your old lady... Like, ever... I mean, yeah, any time. You've been painting a long time. Have you ever, like, been painting and... Y'all have paint and you be painting a lady or something and y'all have, you know, get into it. I don't know. So that is got, the stupidest shit I've never heard uh, never in my damn life. life. The, the answer would be no then let's move on. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's the dumbest shit I <laughs> That'd be no. Jesus Christ. Maybe, maybe it's the Ciroc. <laughs> it was definitely the damn Ciroc. Have you tried have you tried body painting before though? I have not painted on the body. Okay. Yeah. Is there some is there something you would like to try? Uh, probably not. Okay. Um, I'm not one of those. You know, I love to see, you know, body art because when I went butt to Key, when I went to Key West, <laughs> he, he liked to see butt naked hoes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I like to paint somebody body. Well, well, lately, lately I noticed. Just, uh, can I paint your body? I'm paint your body tonight. <laughs> 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 hey, you got some paint on your ring. <laughs> Oh, pop the truck. <laughs> pop the truck. Pop man. the it's truck. Like, we'll be painting tonight. We'll have to paint the second prayer second. Oh, my second. God, man. Y'all done? Yeah, we done. Yeah, we done. Yeah, we done. For, for right we done. Oh, okay. Uh, I, noticed, I noticed lately, Raymond, and it's fitting because it's Black History Month, um, that you've done a lot of, like, uh, social injustice and inequality paintings. Now, before we... We're going to put up some, and we're going to talk about them, and you, uh, you kind of explain to us what they mean and... The significance of them and things of that nature, but why? I mean, is there a reason why you sort of went that, been going that way lately? Is it has it, does it have anything to do with Black History Month, or is it just a mood? Or um, to be honest, when I, yeah, when I graduated ECU in two thousand and six, um, I kind of went right into the workforce. I kind of like stopped painting and drawing. Um, so when COVID hit, I kind of like jumped back into it, and that was kind of around the time when George Floyd, you know, was murdered. Right. Um, so, so this is the time you got back into paint. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So just, just happened. So, so, yeah. so COVID gave you the opportunity to get back into paint. Yeah, yeah, yes. correct. Because it kind of like you know, kind of the world kind of stopped Stop. yeah. for a second. Right. Sure. And you know, I was like, 
what do I do with my downtime? Mm -hmm. um, so a lot of the um, galleries in Greenville reached out and said, you know, would you put on a show? They asked you that? Yes. Oh, okay, nice. Mm -hmm. um, so I went downtown, you know, I painted some murals. Um, in Greensboro? Greenville. Greenville. Oh, Greenville. Which, which we have a couple pictures of those we're going to yeah. show in a few. Yeah. Right, 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 right. Yeah. yeah, in Greenville. So I did three murals um, during that time frame. And then after that, we did the um, the Black Lives Matter in the street. Yeah, okay. Big cities like have. You can see area view. Area view. Yeah, area. Um, like, like most big cities have. Yeah. So you had a bunch yeah. of artists with you working at this Correct. Time. We had 18 okay. different artists. Okay. Um, so we started our own like um, committee with, um, gosh, it's, I cannot remember the name of it. Save my life. Well, good but thing. um, <laughs> you don't try. I'm saying, boy, you be guilty. Good thing you don't need to save your life. <laughs> 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 hey, as your wife yeah. is cool. But yeah, we started. <laughs> we, we started. Or, we started an organization. Pitt, um, Pitt County Creatives. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm think I'm totally saying it wrong, but um, it's a group of us. It's 18 artists. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we painted. We painted in the street. Um, we painted unite um, against racism in the streets. Um, yeah, no doubt. And I think that's one of the pictures that you guys have. Yeah. Um, so um, I did the letter A um, in the street. Did so. you get you <laughs> I'm sorry. I think Ellis Henderson said 158. 158. Not 158. Correction. Yeah. He said 158. Yeah, he said 158. Who invited? He just said 158. He said 158. I think I said 158. So they gave, you just did one letter because you had 18 artists. Is that right? Yeah, we had diff 18 different artists yeah, okay. that, was, that okay. was working on different stuff. I'm about to say, they um, showed it you, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> just give him a letter so you don't screw it up. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah that's, pretty much, that's pretty much how it built up. Um... You know, during COVID, you know, I did some murals for some local shops in Greenville. Mm -hmm. um, I did some murals. I did um, a Nipsey Hustle mural yeah. in one of my, my friend's shop. Um, he, has, he has his own cryo shop. Big shop out the mic. Um, so, you know, I did a mural there. I did a mural at my friend's What shop. you guys see on your screen right now, by the way? At um, Chicken and Waffles. Um, he has his own chicken spot in Little Washington. So, you know, I've been I've been busy with the art piece, you know, just exposing myself as much as possible. No doubt, no doubt. Um, during COVID. But um, I really have, you know, got back into it, you know, once COVID hit. How long does it take you to do one of those murals? Like, say, the, um, the chicken and the, the Nipsey Hustle one, it took me, gosh, I think I, was, I worked on that one for maybe like a month. Okay. Out, really? In wow. Out, in and out. You know, I, I didn't say I worked on it consistently, like, you know, eight hours. I mean, straight. I'm still right. waiting on my Kobe Brown one, so um, I can put it over in my man cave and stuff, yeah. but I ain't got it let yet. Me, but we're going to get yeah, it. Let me ask you, we, like, we, does it make a difference, like, with rain, the weather, all the stuff that plays a part as well? Yeah, yeah. If it's, like, you yeah, go back over and Yeah, yeah. If it's, out, if it's outside, weather does play a part. Um, sometimes it's extremely hot. <laughs> so sometimes it's like 100 degrees. Then you need some water out there, Yeah. Especially if you're working on a wall and the heat bouncing off the wall. Yeah. It's like. You know, ten times the heat comes. Does that play a part as far as the colors go? You have to like go over the spot more than No, it, it doesn't have to. Go, it doesn't play a part in kind of like the color, but you well, know, I guess it kind of you know. it kind of depends on the kind of paint you're using, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, oh, yeah. now, he, now he's the expert. Well, I, well, I, I kind of figured that. Yeah, but you're. I, I, I kind of thought it was kind of. Yeah, but you're. Cool. I'm like, but you're you're pouring sweat at that time, so dehydration uh -huh. kicks in. You know, oh, no making doubt. sure you're drinking a lot so of water. Dizzy out there. Yeah, you get a little dizzy sometimes. Now, are you trying to up your price by selling all this stuff right here? Are we are we like? <laughs> <laughs> so you're saying you're gonna do a lot of stuff to make this thing? Yeah, happen. yeah. If you're working outside, it, it yeah. does. Weather does play a point. You gotta watch the weather and kind of like when it's gonna rain, what kind of temperature is gonna be outside, and all that kind of stuff. So, if you're working outside, you gotta kind of plan ahead. No so, so let me ask you this, and, and maybe this does not correlate. And it was just timing, it seemed like. So, Black History Month didn't play a part in any of your projects, or no? Um, pretty much all of my all of my stuff was completed before Black History. Okay. Um, the last show that I put on um, at one of the local breweries in Greenville. Listen to him, y'all. He big time. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, it was it was geared towards Black History. I yeah. think I put up seven different pieces. Yeah, in that, okay, in that yeah, show. I saw that. Okay, um, so you know, um, I did a lot of reading. Um, I studied um, James Baldwin, um, Claude Anderson. So I do a lot of reading outside of. So I have no idea who the fuck they are. You probably heard of James Baldwin before. Most sure. he doesn't know who James Baldwin. Is. Yeah, that's sad. It's okay. Who is that? That's that what it is. Yeah. 
But yeah, yeah. I, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> fucked up, right? <laughs> <laughs> Who was James Ball? Who was that? Who, what, what did he paint? <laughs> he's not an artist, no, you know. He's, he, yeah, he's more of an author and a writer. Oh well, okay, cool. So you know, he was yeah, he was kind of oh, oh, you yeah. know who it was James yeah. Baldwin. Yeah, yeah. but yeah, the, the boy of, lied. Yeah, oh, what yeah. What, what book did he wrote? Yeah. Did he write? Did he wrote? Did he wrote? <laughs> <laughs> what book did he wrote? <laughs> I don't know. Shit. Oh, good. <laughs> Yeah, but name one you ain't gonna know. Yeah, yeah, but James Bond. Sure won't. I thought King James wrote. (laughs) You can see how we get off topic real quick, though. Real quick. (laughs) King James ain't write that one, big dog. Yeah. New King James old. How does how does how does how does how does reading um like. James Baldwin's work, and I, who was the other author or painter? I don't know. Cla- Claude Anderson, he was an author as well. Okay, Claude Anderson, I'm not familiar with him. But how how does reading their material help you? It just, you know, it drives you to say, you know, how African Americans can kind of push into that direction that yeah. to make us successful. Yeah, of saying like, you know, we can build our own community versus yeah, right. going to them. To another community. Yeah. 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 Oh, he said you know. them. Yeah. <laughs> he said he, he said them. <laughs> so, Who know. the fuck is I them? Know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't answer my own. Chat system, so I ain't know how you felt. What are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? Oh, <laughs> hey, I'm about to mute this damn mic right now. Mute you too. Mute you too. I like that, G. Wait, he's going to be good. Oh, man. That was pretty good. Boy, change your show. You never know. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, we just yeah. I'll be black next week. <laughs> oh, no doubt. <laughs> you know, us as you know, African Americans, we need to not just build a neighborhood. We need to build a community. Say, okay, no doubt. you know, Crazy. so we're we're giving out the resources, so yeah. everything stay within our resources. And, right. You know, you know, instead of going having to go out of, outside of our community, right. you know, and that's what Claude Anderson was doing, and that's what Nipsey Hussle was doing. He was yeah. building within his community. Sure. So you know, most people don't want to see us. Organized, yeah, right. Um, so that's 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 the key there. You know, they want us to mobilize. Yeah, they want us to go out. Oh, boy, no, no, <laughs> we we so need to mobilize. Like, uh, mobilize. <laughs> so the artwork right now and what you're doing in galleries and stuff, you're bringing people together and you are um, investing in your own community. You're pretty much bringing the community together. That's what you. That's what you're trying to do with your artwork. Yeah. Bring awareness, things of that nature. Correct. Yeah. Let me ask you a question. What is Black History? Does Black History? I know you did. You just did a Black History uh, a show or, or catered towards Black History seven years. What does that mean to you? Like, does it have like a meaning? Like, when you think about Black History Month, does that like does that does that mean? Let me ask you first. Hold on, before I go to you, mean anything to you? Absolutely not. Okay. Mean, <clears throat> does it mean much to you? <laughs> you ain't the one. We'll get the one. We'll get the one. We'll get the one. We'll get the one. Like, oh, it's most. <laughs> <laughs> the boy almost snapped, didn't he? Okay, the boy about to turn around. I like it. Not expecting that response. Yes, no, <laughs> hey, boy, you never know what <laughs> But I, I, I'll explain why later. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I feel like Black History is very important because we are the history. Black History Month. Just the month, not just the yeah, history. yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's different. Black feel, History yeah, and Black yeah, History yeah. Month. I, I feel like the month is. Not that important. I don't want you to sit here and say, "Hey, we're gonna celebrate only black people yeah. within this month." Yeah. There you go. Martin Luther, Martin Luther King. There you go. He took my he he, like, he took my reason. Like like the high profile people. Sure. Right. Because I like in high school, that's all we learned about. We didn't learn about like James Baldwin and all those. Guys. I I, I mean, no, I'm gonna wait. Go ahead. I I say my piece in a minute. Go ahead. Yeah. Well, so, well, shut the fuck. Well, shut up. Like like you interrupt yeah, people yeah, all the time. Let him talk. Let him talk. <laughs> Boy, he, he, he's so he, ready. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but I I feel like Black History they cram everything into one month, mm-hmm. and you know the shortest month, by yeah, the way, the shortest month. And seeing what my son is studying in school is kind of like everything's crammed into one month. And then after that, okay, we're studying Adolf Hitler the rest of the semester. Right. I'm saying like, hey, don't don't touch my mic no I'm more. <laughs> Do not touch my mic. <laughs> Yeah, but you know, just that kind of stuff. It's kind of like, why? Why do you only focus it on yeah. it in February? Yeah, for sure. Does Black History Month does it does it have a big in, impact on you, your family? How you how do you feel? Like, is it important? I would say it used to when I was back uh, younger, <coughs> going to you know in church and stuff, doing a little Black History yeah. plays. It made a difference then because I had to remember somebody's like Booker T. Washington, something, something. 
But as I got older, it's like, okay, we're doing this again. It's yeah. Black History Month. It's, it's like this group change. It's like, okay. <laughs> like Christmas. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Halloween this time. It's like it's, it's, I mean, I mean, it's rolled with whatever yeah. going on. <sighs> it's you two know. things about it that really just irritate. One, I don't have a problem with Black History Month as I, I, I would like to see Black History Month sort of expand. But I you think, only learn about certain people. Well, let, let me finish. Exactly. I think, I think yeah. our job with Black History Month is, and it should be everybody's job, but especially in our community, is if you're going to use that as a time where your kids or young people start learning about Black History, you should let that be a springboard for the rest of the year. Every month. More life. You know, but the things I have wrong, the things that I really irritate me about Black History Month, uh, or I guess that I create some time is, Number one, it's safe. We do the safe stories. Correct. No doubt. And then number two, Martin Luther King had a dream. Yeah, boy, we boy, know. But we highlight. I have a dream speech. Yeah, right? we know. That's what we. That's the highlights of right. you know, Jackie Robinson. Correct. You know, like Rosa Parks that I asked on the bus. We know. You know those. Oh, we know. Check, check. Don't get you. <laughs> well, well, I'm. Check, I'm, check, I'm don't get you. Look, she, she, look, she, <laughs> she ain't do nothing but sit her black ass uh, down. That's, <laughs> that's all she did. She was tired, Jamal. No, no. no. Listen. I need to go. No, but seriously, she was tired and she sat the fuck down. Well, 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 what a normal tired motherfucker do. Yes. But if you know, if you know Black History, she, she wasn't. She was the first one. She was not the first. Yeah, no. First so, one. But but my thing is, those are the two things with Black History Month. Sometimes, like, well, that's the one, that's the one we crown. We crowned her. Correct. Did we? But but yeah, we did. Yeah. <laughs> But there was an initiative at that time with right. a boycott movement that was about to take place that they needed something to spark. And so, but I'm not gonna get into all that. But like I said, those are the things with Black History Month that kind of like just sometimes irritate me. Like if we're gonna teach Black history, we should teach Black history the good, the bad. We we, we should yes sir. We should highlight it all. And I don't like how we just highlight the high, I have a dream speech. Right. And. You know, we you, you ain't gonna learn about Malcolm. We're, I'm gonna tell you that well, right well, now. Well, my kids will. I, I no, 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 you, yeah, no. Yeah. But in that school, you ain't. No, no, no. My, yeah, Max, no. And, and, and your and, and your son's school no, no, and your no, daughter's school. No, no. You're not gonna learn about ML. I mean, you're not about gonna learn Malcolm about X. Huey P. Newton. You're not gonna learn about Stoker Clark Markle. No. Not, I mean, it's a lot of these folks. You're not gonna. You're not gonna no. learn about Fred Hampton. You're no. not gonna learn about those. No. You're not gonna learn about the people who got holes on the sidewalls that the name never made the paper. Right, right. Like those, like those images and some of those things you may never see if you don't show them to me. It's a yeah. lot of black history that is suppressed yeah. until we bring it to light and we actually teach our children. And that's the thing that I really don't like about sometimes um, and, and don't get me wrong, every you, you gotta be careful in the age of what you give a child. Like at the age, it's, it all should be age specific. Correct. You know what I mean? Like I, I'm not saying show a, a three year old a hanging a hanging body. I'm not saying that. I'm right. just simply saying that. The real history. Yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying <clears throat> but you gotta give it to them and, and you don't want to have a kid in, sta in, 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 in stages of age. Of course. Yeah. Right. Um, but that's the thing about black history. Then after black history, we're done with it. Correct. Right. And that really just like, yeah, it just, I don't know. It just does something to me. Like, yeah. well, we had it. Let's move on. Yeah. March, yeah. Now we're back to Correct. Christopher Columbus sail to uh, the, the <laughs> sea blue. <laughs> hey, look, you know, check it out though. But I didn't know this until hey, I watched the uh, blackish one episode that, Blackish. Blackish. Okay. It was more to that. I have a dream speech than yeah. Well, you than what it was. It was kind of edited because with his real speech, a real speech was a whole new different speech. Well, well what did y'all know that Bill Cosby? After I have a dream that people, to me, that people should really look. Did y'all know that Bill Cosby oh. bought the speaker system for the I have a dream speech? No, I didn't know. Yeah, that. I, yeah. Really, Bill Cosby. Well, where you at now? Locked up. <laughs> <laughs> Let me ask you the question. Do you have right now? Do you? We gonna get into like some of your pieces. Do you have right now? Do you have our? Yeah, the more off the chain. Don't don't worry about it. Do you uh? This is a rock. <laughs> <laughs> that's all. Um, this is that's all that it is. Black Hip Shop or Diddy. <laughs> but it's all this is a rock. <laughs> we buy it if it does pop. <laughs> Chad, it's not me. Chad, Chad, you do it. Boy, I'm saying. Oh, wow. oh my God! Right now, where where can people go to see your artwork? Um, <laughs> What do you have your artwork on display at right now? Um, my Instagram. Um, Chad, Chad's Instagram. <laughs> Chad, drink. Oh, my fault. Look, I, I'm chilling. I'm over here chilling. Go, go ahead, G. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, um, at Raymond Garfield um, is my Instagram. Um, I take commission pieces, so if you have ideas of kind of artwork that you want me to complete, Come you, know, you know, you <laughs> know. Send me. Now, 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 let's tell you this. Let me tell you this story. Here we go. Here we go. 
go ahead, go ahead, spill. Man, hold on, finish, finish where you can eat your stuff from. Finish your stuff. Yeah. <laughs> he love it. Um, <laughs> yeah, Instagram is pretty much where um, my handles are. So most people reach out to me through my Instagram. So that's well, which is on the screen for you right now. Raymond Golf at Raymond Golf. Before Chad speak, you also got something else coming up. Is it okay to talk about that? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Let, let like, get the people about what you got coming up. Yeah, um, things, all that. I'm jazz. opening up a new business. Um, okay. Save your art. Give me a clap for that, man. Black well, is that on your shirt? Is that on your shirt? That is indeed. Check um, it out. Me and my business partner, um, Chad. You know, he's a caterer. I ain't you know, going to business with you. Not this Chad. He's <laughs> on the black Chad. Black Chad. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Um, he's a caterer. He's, you know, A+. plus. So, um, we're we're starting up a business. Um, so, hopefully, we open our doors June 1st. Nice. Um, opening up a gallery, um, art and design classes. Um, I'm going to be there. Different classes that you can, you know, work on. Figuring out how to paint and draw and that kind of thing. Um, so we, we're setting up a venue for people that's getting married. So Chad, if you decide to get married eventually, boy, we'll, stop. Yeah, yeah. Look, he, don't, he don't like women, so he probably won't get. It. No, I'm that's sorry. a whole new episode. That's a okay. different episode, right? Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. What, what, what? Now, there ain't right? no different damn episode. Hold on, we address that right now. Oh. <laughs> ain't no fault. I ain't gonna no attack y'all. There ain't no different episode. I don't want to attack y'all. Will, will the artwork be on display where people can purchase artwork yes. as well? Yes. Yes. Um, we're gonna have we have plenty of wall space. Um, it's three levels to the. The venue that wow. we're purchasing. Nice. So, um, in the but what also you all you buying? We're renting the space. Oh, okay. 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 But what's the same person? So in the in the in the centerpiece. So in the centerpiece is pretty much all the way through, so you can see up to the to the third level. Nice. Okay. Um, we have an area for um, a DJ, whole boom, you know, the whole nine yards. And, then, so, and this is in Greenville. No, this is not in Greenville. This is outside of Greenville. This is going to be in our Rocky Mount. Rocky oh, Mount, Rocky North Mountain. Carolina. Okay. Right. So cool. when you get the information, you got to give it to us so we can help share it and get it out yeah. to the people yeah. for your yeah. grand yeah. opening. Yeah. That's going to yeah. be so, dope. So and mass out. required, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> That is massive. And his name is on the screen right now. Make sure you go follow that brother. Send the man some requests. Yeah. Don't ask him. On IG. If the man tell you a price, support him. That's the price. That's At the Raymond price. Garfield right there. If you ask for $1,000, you can pay $1,000. <laughs> it better be worth $1,000. Okay. If you ask for $1,000. Okay. So $1,000 Kobe Bryant, you got it. I'm waiting for the Kobe Bryant. I ain't no seen doubt. it yet. I no doubt. You know, man, gonna give me a postcard. Or gonna give me a mural, canvas. I'm waiting. Nah, I got you. But I got, I got my joint in, man. I want to put it on display. I can't wait to see it. You know what I'm saying? So I, I appreciate that. But let, let's let's take a look at it. We got a few pieces we want to take a look at. I want you to kind of give us some, you know, give us some background on it. The first one was the Nipsey piece that you talked about. Chad gonna put it up on the screen here for mm -hmm. you. We can check it out. Um, I got it right here for us. Right here for us, uh, Jamal. And it looked just like that cat. So we got the Nipsey piece. So tell us a little bit about this piece. What's going on here? Um, this piece I did I it in my friend's you. shop. Um, he has he owns a cryotherapy spot in Greenville. Um, he just told me that I can pretty much freestyle and do whatever I wanted to do. Okay. Um, on the wall. So And that's um, dope as hell right there, bro. So Most you dead. know, Nipsey Hustle right. is, is someone I listens to I listen to a lot. Um so I kinda did a profile picture of Nipsey Hustle and I kinda put some of his quotes uh, kind of around his um, image that's in the very center of it. Okay. Um, and I see so, the word change at the top. That's dope. Yeah, yeah. So you know he was <clears throat> you know, he was very positive, kind of giving back to his community. He was trying to rebuild his community, um, so but of course, you know, he fell short. You know, yeah. he, got, he got killed in his own community. So, you know, he was building those building blocks stuff, kind of like right. building up his community, giving back to his community. And it's so, so sad to see how his store looks now. Correct. Boarded up looking. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's crazy. Up? Yeah. So the store shut down. It's crazy, bro. Pretty much, pretty I didn't much, realize what, the store pretty shut much down. everything that he was pushing towards is kind of like stopped once he. Was a, well, I, was, I wouldn't say assassinated. So, uh, so I didn't realize. Yeah, yeah, he was assassinated. That's I, exactly I, I what realized it. at the time when he got a, when he got killed. Yeah. When he when he was assassinated or what have you, he um everybody was buying up all his clothes, and I know everything was going to his estate at the time. But like they like I saw celebrities buying out the store, Game Ti. Yeah. They bought out right. the store. I, I know I purchased a shirt. Just try to support where I could. Yeah, I bought I bought two shirts actually, and they're kind of high, but, but <laughs> <laughs> I, I paid the price. I paid the price. But what I'm saying is, I understand. I understand. Like everybody was buying, so I I thought maybe the estate was like really growing. So I, I didn't know. I had no idea that the actual store had closed. What well, actual neighborhood where he was building? Where he actually got shot at? Yeah. He got shot at his own. Yeah, spot. I know. Yeah. I know. In the in the in, in the super, I mean, in the market. I mean, yeah. in the uh, yeah. a little strip mall. Yeah, so right. the strip mall got so I didn't realize that. 
far as I know, it was shut down. I don't know if it's open now. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't. I just said. I didn't oh, know. I, I, I want to say I just seen these pictures a few days ago. Yeah. Wow. That it was kind of boarded up and wow, going up. Wow, I hate to see that, man. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So the next one we got. Let me see if I can find it on mine. But it's it's the uh, lady with the um, the cup of coffee with the shades. No, the lady with the shades. Does I got a bathroom? <laughs> Oh, you got a you have here? <laughs> I do. And you got to go that bad. Hey, don't kiss me on seven. Come on here. Hey, 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 Raymond, hey, Raymond, hey, be hey, right. Hey, Raymond, 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 to you, who, who was one of the, give me one person to stand out to you. Like, what's, what's a black history figure that really, like, stands out to you? My pops. No doubt. Okay. Reason why? The hero. Okay. He the GOAT. Okay. No say it. What about you, Jim? I would say my mom. Oh, wow. I would call her the ultimate hustler. Yeah. I mean, to, to, to raise me and even though it was a little town of raised, but we had a lot of stuff going on. People didn't realize. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Most of them. And did. she, I ain't going to say she protected me from me, even though we stayed on the same street. I could have been yep. in so the same place. Some go. of those same other dudes that we yeah. grew up with, all of us grew up with. Yeah. For some reason, I grew up in the same street, but I still stayed away from that. So I gave my mom the proper. What about you, Clay? Um, I, I would be, it, it would be, I would be shameful if I didn't say my mom and my dad. You know, I lost my dad when I was 15. But he was kind of, you know, my mom and them say separated a few years before that or whatever. Right. Um, definitely my mom and dad because they, they was my first teachers. They was the ones who I saw, you know, daily and got my... Learn the struggle from. Yeah, everything. I mean, you know, I, I watched my mom go to work every day of her life to try to provide. You know, life wasn't perfect. Uh, our relationship wasn't perfect. We've had our ups and downs. Probably more so my fault than any. But, like, one thing she always done is, you know, I never saw my mom on drugs. My mom was not... A drinker, right. right? Wasn't on drugs. We didn't drink. She was a strong figure. She she worked, did her best to provide, and I, I'm in debt for it. I'm in debt to her for life for that. No doubt. Of that. So, no, doubt. no doubt. But outside of my household, like I got, I got a few. I mean, you know, like I'm. A, I'm give, a, give give us number one. <clears throat> just off the rip, probably Michael Mix is probably one of my most. Okay. Probably my one of my most revered heroes. No doubt. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so. Let's get back to these paintings. Yes. Since All right. So the next one. Um, <laughs> hey, before we get into the paint, um, going back to middle school, when in Mr. Weiner's class, we had a dope art class. Um, in, the, in that art class, it was Marcus Lee, Doobie. Lance Hayes, Moss, Ross, all the got a platinum, platinum record. Yeah. I remember yeah. Um, who else is there? Curtis Pickett. I don't know if y'all remember. Him. Yeah, I remember yeah. Curtis Pickett. Yeah. Yeah. Curtis strong Pickett. handshake. Yeah. Super strong. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> um, I didn't know he could draw them. Oh, yeah, he, he could. He could. I didn't know that. Um, Carl Ross. Yeah, Carl Ross. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, I, CJ, what up? What up? Yeah, what young, up, young what Dirk. up, what up, bro? I guess a young Dirk now. Yeah. Um, there we go. Um, he was he was awesome. He was at EC with me for maybe like I think a year and a half. Oh yeah. Yeah. He's always um, drawing. I remember drawing. Was Lance Hash could draw. Up. Lance Hash was in yeah, that I class. Doesn't have um, Thomas Herbin could draw. Thomas Herbin was in there. Darius I used Cobb. to try to keep up with them by Darius, they was Darius, Darius, Darius Cobb. Shout out to Darius Cobb. What up, Darius? Yeah. Darius Cobb was nice too. Yeah. And John Russell was in John there too. Russell, yeah, John, man, rest man, in peace. Man, rest in yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I pity John yeah, Russell, man. Yeah, John Russell was nasty. God bless the day. Um, was, you know, he Keep Cummins. Yeah, yeah. And God bless the day as well. Yeah. Oh, I pity Keep Cummins yeah. for sure. Yeah. Definitely yeah. a dope ass artist. Like of, he did our middle school like uh the yearbook. He did the cover. Yeah. He was the first one or the only one I knew. Yeah. He started doing tattoos or yeah. 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 Kings yeah. was doing the tattoos yeah. and then, yeah. you know, unfortunately yeah. he passed. John, John Russell was, he was. Yeah, he, John Russell was, John was he, tight. He was tight with his, with his yeah. art. Yeah. 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 Left-handed too, I believe. Yeah. He was left-handed. Yeah. yeah, I remember that so vividly. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He was super dope. All right, so the next one was the girl, the girl with the shades. Tell us what's going on in this pic right here, man. Um, so pretty much on the, um, yeah. the left side, you can see it's an older lady. Yep. Um, and then on the right side, it's a younger lady. Um, so when you see in the shades, I didn't realize yeah. that. Till I just hold on. The left side is a younger lady. It's a younger older version lady. of her than the older. Is this the same split, picture we looking yeah, at? Yeah, okay. Split image down the middle. So I didn't notice that. Did you said that? I didn't, I didn't, that. Get, that I didn't yeah, get that either. Yeah. So on the left side, you see mm -hmm. her in her reflection. She see you know Turn a slaves lined up. 
And then on the right side, you see Trayvon Martin. Right, Tra- his, I thought it was Trayvon. With wish. his hoodie on. Oh, that's dope. So it's pretty much showing, you know, the decades of kind of like the same thing that's going on in Nothing the world. has changed nothing throughout really, time. Nothing right. really has changed. We um, ain't even so, filming it now. Yeah, I kind of right. got I kind of got the idea from um, my grandma lived to be like 101. So, you know, she saw what happened back in the day and she saw what was happening now. So she was like, really nothing has changed. That's the only sad. difference is... Because people don't, 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 don't realize that segregation was just like 70 years ago. Correct. Like a it make it, yeah, it make I mean, it, it was so not that long ago, yeah, bro. Make it so bad they put it in black and white so to make it feel like it was years ago, yeah. but it wasn't. Like right. my mom was the last grade graduating class. Yeah, you said that before. Segregated, yeah. like she yeah. graduated. Booker T. Washington. She didn't go to Reesville. The next yeah. year, Reesville High started. Yeah. She was the last segregate. So your mom was the first year? She was the first year. See, my mom was the last year, Booker T. They was the last. And that's when y'all saw winning them championships. Class. Mm-hmm. Like black, black boys got gotcha. you. My mom went to segregated school. Yeah. Right, that's yeah. crazy. So, yeah. so that's how. It's not that long ago. Not that far removed. Not at all. No. My mom went to segregated school. Yeah. yeah. She graduated from segregated school. Yeah. It's, it's, so. Yeah, it's very sad when you, when you look at it and kind of yeah. like see like it. Things really hasn't changed. No, it's, it's just filmed. Yeah. Now it's recorded. Yeah. No, no, no. Thing, yo, though, and still nothing's changed, even no. though it's recorded. Look, when I was in school, and this was in the 90s, late 90s, we actually had a white bus and a black bus then. You had a what? In band. And y'all can ask anybody that's been in band. Oh. Even my mom had it. Yeah, we always had a white bus and a black bus. Yeah. Oh, you're talking about gone. black people on one bus, yes. white people on another bus? Yes. Mm. Wow. And, and this is no lie. And this is the thing was, it was so, we were so conditioned to it, like, say if you showed up late to the game, you rush to get on the bus, this is no lie. If you got on the wrong bus, somebody got on there and say, wrong bus? <laughs> I promise you, you get on that bus. Oh, my God. Bus. Wow, that's crazy. That is crazy. Like, that is I didn't know that. But thank you, we told it as a joke because all the white people just naturally well, got on one well, bus. I didn't know you and all the bad person, Yeah, and all the bad people got on, on another bus. What'd you play? Two uh, bus. Um, <laughs> he, he, had, he had a tall sock so <laughs> the tall tube socks. He <laughs> <laughs> was an awesome. Shots to the boys on the drum line. He <laughs> <laughs> was an awesome. He was playing tube on the flute. <laughs> what? Hit him with a flat of the boom. Flat of the bumblebee. <laughs> Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah. That was a good one. That was a good one. I played it right after my oh, oh, shit right after the I did it for the girls, man. What you play though? Huh? What you play though? Bass drum. I played some of them. Oh, so you did boom. I never knew that. Boom, boom, I boom. Did. You already got it. You don't need the paperwork for that. No. Hey, that is that is point at you when you ready to hit the drum. You got a point. Yeah. You don't need no rhythm or nothing. You just keep hitting. Boy, I'm um, jokes. Like, oh my God! Thanks for got to play. Like, I, I, never, I, never, I, never, I never, I never knew that though. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, I had a good time. Yeah, I did. I, I, I didn't know that. Oh my God! Oh, I didn't know that. Even though we're doing school, but just like you're two years ahead of me. So two years, yeah. Same. I didn't know he was in. Your sister was a senior when I was. You probably, you probably, you probably was in the corner drawing at that time. Let's go. Full of jokes. All right, the next one is Jamal. He wanted to fly to the boom beat. All right, I'm sorry. Oh, you want to talk about bands? You know what? Never mind. Never mind. I'm talking about bands. What about us? You got a picture similar. The next picture is like the guy with the shades. Um, so it's very similar. It's a split. Um, so on the left side. You see an older guy, and then on the right side, you see a younger guy. So on the right side, you see Trayvon Martin again, and then on the left side, you see George Stigney. That was, that was who? the first. I mean, George Stigney. That was and who the first was African American kid that got electrocuted by a chair. Yeah, he at was, 13. Oh, right? wow. 13, oh, wow. 13 years yeah. old. Um, he was yeah. tried as an adult. You see Jamal? Yeah, um, yeah. So he, Boy, you know. His, <laughs> just like I didn't parents, know. <laughs> yeah, his parents. He just, he, just got, he just got pardoned. Mm-hmm. Uh, found not guilty. 2004. 2004. Yeah. No doubt. So, wow. He was, yeah, he was, wow. He was, yeah, he was, yeah, he was arrested for killing two white young females. Two, and wait, the trial was two hours about two hours. Like, and two hours. Hours. Now, how long ago was it? Know your black history. It was, it was, what what it was, year was it? It was nineteen what forty nine. It, it was a long time ago. I can't remember the year. It wasn't it was like fifties, the fifties. Yeah, yeah, it, it was, was too, early on. 
Oh wow! It was, it was the forties. It wasn't even. Either way, you, you see the you, you see the pictures with the silver top yeah. on his head. This, yeah, you yeah. know when they got him in a electric chair. No family, no, no lawyer. Family. Oh, his family. His family moved out of town because they was getting threatened so yeah. much. So his family wasn't even present. The mom didn't even see him again Did, until he at the funeral. That's yeah. when she saw him again. And wow. Dead. Thirteen years old, two hour trial. Yeah. He was electrocuted. And they tried and, as and an then, adult. And thing is, the cops they starved him. Out of confession, so yeah. they didn't feed him anything until he confessed that he did it, and then once he confessed, that's wow. It, and that's Google it. Go it find went. the pictures. Go look at. Yeah, it's it's, it's a scenery. yeah, it's a, it's mean, a very wow. Story. You talk, that's what I mean by like black like this is like this is stuff that is right. yeah. This talk is, about what we the real yeah, stuff. Yeah, right. Yeah, the real stuff. Cause you know the stuff us, that makes it black history. Yeah, yeah. Cause right. us as blacks, we didn't black history didn't start. As us being slaves, it didn't start. With it was, not at all. It, it started not. way before that. Of I was like, we had a, a life before the boats yeah, came. No and took queens, us away. No queens, queens, you know, no so it, it's not a topic that we can graze through and try to be safe with. Right. And, like you, if you feel some type of way, you should. As as everybody should, because it's a time. If you're a human and you're for equality and you're for the love of your neighbor. It should make you cringe. It should make you feel some type of way inside. Right. It should be uncomfortable. Because yeah. it's uncomfortable to see, it's uncomfortable to hear, yeah. it's uncomfortable to be around. It should right. be that way. That's how it's supposed yeah. to be. Because right. it's the truth. Yeah. You know what I mean? It shouldn't be um, the safe passage. And let's just talk about uh, sports yeah. and things of that nature. Right. It's a lot of people, a lot of a lot of people who lost their lives, a lot of families that got yeah. uh, disrupted because of yeah. you know things that went on in this yeah. country. Yeah. Um, so it, it's not it's not to be taken lightly. It's like. But let's not let's not gaze upon it as if it, you know. Oh, Jackie Robinson played baseball, and I'm not saying what he did what he did wasn't great. He was a pioneer in what he right. did. But there's a lot of people who really who really put their life on the line, mm -hmm. um, you know. And there's a lot of it's a lot of people who lost their lives fighting for a cause of the better men of our people, you know. And and you know, and, and, and I'm not just saying just all black people. I mean, uh, people of other races as well. Right. You yeah. know. So I'm just saying. But like when we talk about that history, like. That that's a beautiful yeah, point. Yeah. I didn't realize that's what that was. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Because my with my but artwork, I definitely know the story. Yeah, with my artwork, I that's what I try to push towards is yeah, that's to make dope. you to that make you dope. go back to do your research. That is dope. You know, just to say, hey, who is this guy? That is right. dope. So they go back and Google it, and then they do the research. You okay. know, that's that's how I want my artwork to impact people that's in the community. So you know, and your artwork like, is dope. For sure. Yeah, it's kind of a history lesson overall. Man, I'm tell you what, that's dope. I, I like I said, that's the reason we breaking this thing down because I didn't know. We don't know. We want you to kind of give us an idea. Yeah, so, so. Um, man, that, that was powerful. All right, so we got the next one is the uh, we got the black couple with the flag. Let me see if I can find that one here on your uh, on your IG here. Um, this one is um, I titled this one embrace. Um, it shows a uh, um, a black male holding um, a black female. It's pretty much you know the black male is crying. Mm -hmm. Um, he just he just pouring out saying you know he loves America but America right. America mm -hmm. really doesn't love him back. Um, oh, oh, and that's dope. Say that one more time right there. You know he you know he loves America but America doesn't love him back. So you know he's he's crying. He's he's holding his his um, mm -hmm. girlfriend, and pretty much the blood is creating the stripes. Gotcha. Um, at the very mm -hmm. bottom, you know, it's showing a female holding her fist up. I see you know, with right the um, the with the black power. Oh so, wow! Okay, you know, I didn't so even see that. You know, so it's and and they can't see it on the screen right now. Okay, that yeah, they, they they can't. Right? Am I right? Is at the bottom. Is it the, the very bottom? bottom? Yeah. Is it the very bottom? Yeah. Is it the very is that bottom? Is a city as well? What is yeah, that? it's a city. It's a city um, right there. So I kind of hit in, hit in the girl holding up her fist. Yeah, I within the within the city. So you know, with my artwork, I just I don't want it to be like bam in your face. So yeah, you can do I'm some little sub subliminal, subtle, yeah, subtle yeah, subliminal yeah, things yeah, in there. Yeah. I want you to look at it. Um, so when you see my work in a gallery, I want you to kind of walk up to it and see what's going on. It should hit you a piece. little different. Make you make you yeah. make you kind of dive into yeah, it. Right. Yeah, yeah. To make you actually look at it. So you can't walk by it and say, "Oh, I know what this is about." Right. So I kind of I want you to I want you to look at it. That's dope. All right. What about uh, the next one? We got the two boys. Uh, it's two boys with a flag. Is what I had notated. Let me see if I can find it. Right here. Yeah, this one is just you know is is kind of parting off, kind of like how you know young males are targeted um in the community um just going back to the previous one we were discussing earlier okay um my son is 13 he's about to turn 14. Oh, wow really? um, wow yeah. so yeah. you know just what is he in ninth grade 10th grade 
about to be a knife, right? Yeah, a knife. Yeah. So just yeah. seeing, just seeing, you know, just imagining him being taken away from me. Yeah. And being executed, and I can't even see him. Yeah. You know, that's very, very scary. Yeah. Um, and you know, that's how pretty much America's kind of set up. You know, it it can get to the point that you know, police can take away your kid mm -hmm. and. All white violated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you don't see them. I'm right. like, especially like, if you don't have the resources, yeah, and the money you know, to like fight. Resources, money yeah. to fight yeah. for. A lot of people you know, fall into that. Yeah, yeah. You're, 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 you're just trapped, and that's, you know, that's how America's kind of, you know, wrapped up in in that kind of situation. Now, the, in these two pictures are they just random faces, or they? Yeah, they're they're random faces. Okay, correct. okay. So nobody of significance yeah. per yeah. se. All right, and then we got the we got the mural that you did. Uh, Unite was it United Against Racism? Yes. Um, I cannot remember their names, um, but yeah. and then, now this is this picture is downtown Greenville. Yeah, that's it is Greenville. Um, it's it's located on First Street. Um, Black creators of Pitt County. That's the name. I knew it was coming. Black through. creators of Pitt County. Yep, correct. Got gotcha. you. Is there? Is um, it? We can go see Yep, yep. It, it is in the street. Um, so it's 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 and it's on First Street it's in on Greenville. Street in Greenville. Got gotcha. you. Um, United Against Racism. Mm -hmm. um, it. It's pretty much a platform for us as artists to get together, um, to have a safe space of of showing our artwork. Okay. Um, so it's eighteen of us, different artists. We have different <clears throat> skills, techniques, and that kind of thing. So we came together, we created this piece. Um, so did, like, did y'all have like a meeting? Yeah. We and had, say, okay, I'm gonna do letters, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. Like, what letters did you do? Yeah, I, I did a. the letter A. a. Um, okay. So with. With this piece, it was a process. Um, Bro, I don't mean city. to cut you off, but I just saw some on your IG page. I just saw some on your IG page that I didn't know was on your IG page. Oh, Lord. Is this a picture of my daughter when she was a baby with the dog? Is that mine? It probably was. I remember when you done this. Bro, I just, bro I just saw this. I remember when you done this. I didn't realize this was still on your IG page. I didn't realize you still had this. I remember you doing this. This is a picture of my oldest daughter when she was a child who is 17 now. I'm just scrolling. I literally just saw this. I'm like, I remember this picture. Yeah. She took with a Santa hat on. Correct. What a, what a, not a Santa hat, but a... Uh, I don't even remember it. I was... It show him, show him. Is that problem. not it? Maybe I'm over... That is, that, that, That's that definitely it. it. Yeah, that is it. That is definitely it. Yeah. I remember that like, like it was yeah. yesterday, bro. Yeah. God damn, bro! I didn't know. I didn't know you had that joint on there, yeah. bro. Man, yeah. I just saw that. Just. Hold on, catch up, Jay. Hey, 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 hey look, 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 look! If you want to, if you want to keep on sucking, we're gonna see him watch. Right? <laughs> you got a mattress, you got a towel right here, man. Wipe it off. You can't even right. give a man's flowers in here. Oh, my that's God. Like, that's my, yeah, that's my baby. Now, let me show. Bro, I just... Let me see. I, I ain't seen it. I just, see. I just happened to be scrolling because I was trying to find the next picture. Yeah, that was... Bro, let me that, see. that's I my think, oldest daughter, a picture I, she took. Yeah, she was, it up. She wasn't even one years old, bro. I think I did that once in, what, college? Yeah, yeah. Drew, oh, I said drawing. Yeah, yeah. Was oh, sketch, okay. He did it my daughter. He sketched my daughter when she was, like, less than one years old. Uh, a picture that she had. It was like a teddy... I mean, like a dog or bear or something. She had, like, a... Uh, Hat on her hair, like a red hat or whatever, red yeah, white hat. I, I remember it like it was yesterday. Yeah. That's mm. you celebrate Christmas. No, no definitely not. So, I so, I so, 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 got to see that now. Yeah, bro, I'm gonna have to go back and show. It. I never knew that, bro. I think I still got that one. Dog, that's dope, man. I didn't even like. I, first time I seen it, just scrolling. I, I wish I had that picture. I can put up. I wish I had it. Hey, look, all they gotta do is go to the IG page. <laughs> <laughs> now just go to the IG page. Indeed. Let me Dang, see. Bro, that's, that's tough right there, man. Do you have an artist you inspired by? Like, you kind of mimic anything um, or just, like, kind of get ideas from? I wouldn't say I mimic a particular artist. Um, okay. I have studied a lot of different artists, like Jacob Lawrence, um, you know, during the Harlem Renaissance type phase. Right. But, you know, I really wouldn't say I kind of, like, keyed into. I you kind of still had your own thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That joint right there hit me a little different. Yeah. I'm sorry. That joint yeah. hit me a little I different. Wanna, right so, you were, were you going to cry in the car? I might, man. That's <laughs> bad. You know what I'm saying? That's a little touching, man. I mean, I, pre I mean, you know, that means a lot, man. Yeah. Kind of like, you know, I kind of like try to find my own lane when it comes to different art. Now, is that frowned upon when an artist kind of mimics another artist? I know it's like it's all creative and then. Yeah, some, yeah, sometimes when you see like someone like, I would say, I would 
I guess you would say biting your style, kind of. Right. You, you would kind of like, okay, you know, <laughs> kind of look. Kind we of know about people biting our style. Yeah, you kind of be like, we know about people biting our style. Boy, think we don't when we do. Yeah. It's a couple of them out there. Yeah, you kind of be like, kind of looks like my stuff. Stop biting that shit, man. Stop biting that shit, dog. But it's but it's tons. But it's tons and tons. Ain't nothing wrong with inspiring. We inspire these dudes, man. Yeah, but it's it's tons and tons of artists out there. So you know. You know, it's sometimes it is an honor to say, okay, this person like, right. okay, I'm it's fine. Yeah, 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 because yeah. you know, yeah, you know, just you know, your different style. You your would technique. never be the only one in the Yeah, yeah, yeah you know, you kind of want to share that information to people. Yeah. I'm, I'm not the kind of artist kind of like, okay, I'm not going to show you how to paint. Right, right, right. No you know, no I'm, I'm the artist kind of like, if you want to learn, I'm going to show you how to right, do it. You know, yeah, X, no Y, and Z. I'm not going to say, hey, I'm not going to show you. And and sometimes it it is hard with. You know, us as African Americans say, "Hey, I'm not going to show you the way." We afraid yeah. it's going to be taken from yeah, us. Yeah, exactly. Gonna be like, okay, now gonna you're going to become, yeah, you're going to become competition to yeah. me versus right. me. You know, working right. together, I mean, to, yeah, you know, yeah, combine exactly. forces. Like so. Yeah, everybody, everybody can eat. Go, yeah, go to the next one. Uh, the one with the uh, it's a lot of it's a lot of like a lot of men along the railroad tracks. Am I am I describing that one right? Is it, is it this one? No, not that one. No, it's this one right here. It's like this one right here, like a wall. With the white, black, the red. <coughs> I ain't got that one. Oh, you a Patriots fan, me though? I am not. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, 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 you I don't seen break up. <laughs> no. Okay. I seen the drawing that you made. I gave you. Well, what yeah. I got, yeah. I got yeah. all of them. No, you don't. Definitely. Yeah. I, don't I definitely have all of them. I don't see that. Did you send? You definitely got all of them. I don't see that. I don't see that one. Yeah, you definitely got all of them, dude. All right, what, what about that one right here? <laughs> so this is pretty much, um, this is a scene like after slavery. Um, it's just depicting how um, how blacks were still captive after slavery, and sometimes blacks didn't hear about slaves being free. Oh, yeah, like so, further west, like Texas. Correct. Yeah, yeah. For, you, as you go west, it's kind of like, year or two you know, you know, cause it, was, you know, Instagram and internet and all that stuff was around, so they yeah. didn't know they were free. Right, exactly. So they were still captive. To the Union um, yeah, Army made it yeah, that way. Yeah, and then uh-huh. once they realized that they were free, you know, the master was like, oh, you still owe me a debt. Yeah. So they still had to work off their debt. No doubt. So that's pretty much showing that. And it's showing on the side. Dog, I wish y'all could see this. Showing, this is so dope. Yeah, it's hey, showing. Hey, y'all can't. <laughs> Just go to the IG Yeah, page. it's showing the um, the souls of the black people of, you know, how dedicated they they still put in work. They still built the railroads. And in the very, in the background, you see the slave masters walking towards the railroad after it was already built. Oh, is that what the red is? And the, is that what the or is that? No, the red part is kind of like the mountains. The oh, okay. Mountains. So in the very, is this is it this one right here? No. At the top right here. Mm-hmm. No. 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 Okay, look at Chad's oh, pictures. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Man. I don't even look at Chad's pictures, man. It was. Like, well, let, let me see what the pictures look like, man. <laughs> Let me see what it look like. Oh, I ain't got that one, bro. Oh, oh, oh my god, man! Really I ain't got that one. I ain't got that one. Right. Right. What about the one? Man. What about the one? There was one with the. It looked like a guy, and he's got a bunch of. It, it looked like maybe oh, lights in the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that one. All right, let's go to that one. Let me see if I can find that one in your IG. This one. Yeah. Yeah, that that one is, is is pretty much depicting um a black male with his hands up, um yeah. on the ground on his knees, and of course you see the police li- police lights. So that's the police lights in the background. Gotcha. That's, okay. That's okay. That, that makes sense. Was. It makes sense now. Um. So it's pretty much depicting you know how black mm-hmm. males, you know, mm-hmm. even though you surrender, you got your hands up. We're surrendering. You're gonna be shot dead. Yeah, and they still yeah. tell you to freeze. Correct. But we're yeah. still terrified. They know you're dead, but they still um, tell you to freeze. You know, cause oh. you know us as black. You know, males, we get terrified when, you know, cops hit the lights on us. Boy, we get terrified um, to see a car without correct. the lights. So we see him on the bridge. We see him on the bridge and we're like, oh, right. man, let me get off the gas. <laughs> oh, no doubt. The bridge gonna pass, boy. You ride right beside yeah, right yeah, it. You yeah, slow down, yeah, I'm slowing yeah. down. So, you know, just, you know, just those things is kind of, you know, what I was going on after that. Just so seeing it in person, it, it's, it, it kind of like, it, it beats off the painting. Um, it's very, very bright. 
um, with the blues and the white. Yeah, yeah, that's what I noticed. I thought those was police lights. I wasn't yeah. sure, but that's yeah. what it looked like. Yeah, I, you could barely vaguely see yeah. the hands up. Correct. Like you, it looked like it was on. It was intentional. Yeah. To make yeah. sure the hands are Correct. faint. You don't see it. Yeah, um, but it, but it, it leaves options yeah. of saying yeah. that yeah. you know. It, oh, they may have had something. Yeah. Correct. I got it. it. it shows, I, I figured that. Yeah, it shows like. It kind of gave a perspective of kind of like what cops see yeah, versus yeah. kind of what we see. I actually call like, it that. Like when I see the painting, I can see the hands. And some people right. can see the hands. And some Barely people, though. And some people can be like, I don't see the hands. Right. You right. know, it, it kind of gives that perspective of kind of like kind of what's going Two on. Two sides of the corner. You know. No I like that. that. That's a dope painting right there. Yeah, it is. Um, What about the girl with the pink bow? What is that? What is um, that with the pink bow, that was that was pretty much a piece I did for um, one of my friends. She owns a tea shop. Um, it doesn't have anything to do with. Um, okay. Kind of like the Black Lives Matter, but um, I kind of like the piece because it, it kind of shows you know African American culture. Um, you know with the with big, her natural hair. Yeah, with the natural hair. Yeah, yeah, um, that's what the, I was looking the at. Headband. But that chair can be long too. Let's be straight long. A nap. Yeah. yeah. No, nap ain't always what's the name. First of all, it's not a course. <laughs> <laughs> You can have natural hair be straight along as well. You know I was having to get curly. Oh God, I was gonna run. I was gonna ruffle some, ruffle some feathers right there, right, man. I know. I, mean, it's only I need, course, mother. I don't even need to be simple side. This guy. <laughs> <laughs> they gonna mess around and jump on me. I know. Out, I know. Man. I know. Doing too much. I get man. back to Gravo, man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh Lord! Sorry, ladies, I'm just playing. No, no, no! It ain't just ladies; it's men too. Yeah, I love black women. <laughs> oh, okay, Raymond. I mean, no, I, I, like I, say, I, I, I love. <laughs> I know this guy into. Uh, <laughs> I love white people. <laughs> what about what about the uh, what about the red light bulb? Now this one seems like it's got a lot going on right here. Oh, hold on, hold on. We don't skip back. Okay. Okay. No. <laughs> Let's talk about this damn bulb, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's move. Let's get off the chat. Chat about getting stuff in trouble. I know he's not. We know who he yeah, is. He's, 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 he's stupid, man. Oh I'm man. Okay. Um, so in this piece, you see, it's a, it is a light bulb, and at the very bottom of the books, it, it's um, people stacked up. And at the very top of the What do you book, mean right here in the white? Is people stacked up? In the white. Yeah, okay. Yeah. At the very bottom. At the very bottom. What is, what is that signifying? I mean, what it's just seeing, it's just showing that people that that's educated. being educated. Being educated. Okay, and then the, bulb once they is, read, the bulb is like yeah. the light coming on. Correct. Once they Can read, you tell the story? No, I'm, <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm getting to tell you the Hey, 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 Gene, I'm here with you. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad you're explaining it. You're making me say everything you say. So it's a basketball. Hey, 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 hey. Go ahead, Gene, ignore these. So, so, you tell oh, you, oh my so, God. So above the books, you see the people. The book won't shut up. So, <laughs> so they're in lighting. Right. You know, after they read the books. Right. You know, so they kind of understand kind of what's going on in the world. Um, it's a series of different books. As you see the titles of the books, that's the outline that I've written. What's the top two? I can't read the top two. Um, Put the face on her, man. Right there, they call you. <laughs> <laughs> the cow jumped over the book. C spot, bro. <laughs> You see what I gotta deal with? I, I see, oh I see, my man. god! It's sloppy though. It's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. Too much to rock. Oh god! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like, I know it. This ain't just rock. It's a list. When they call, <laughs> it's just when they call you something. The first one says when they call you in something. I can't really see. It's too small. I can't. I can't remember what the top one said. Oh wait a minute! You do it. You do it. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know what we laughing at. My man, my man, man, you don't know what you're saying. <laughs> I've done a, I've done a ton of paintings. Right, and sure. I, I, no I, doubt, no I, doubt. I, I can't remember what the top two were oh, saying. What? I know the I know the second one from the top is a James Baldwin. Okay. No name of the street. No I can't name. remember what the top one is. It's all good. The point of the painting is the fact to see people are yeah. reading, educating themselves, okay. and being enlightened. You see and they the rise. very? Can you see at the very top? You see the people are highlighted. Of course. In yellow. Yeah. So they're kind of enlightening, yeah. you know, saying, okay, I'm... So they've been enlightened at that point. Yeah, I'm kind of educated on yeah. kind of what's going on. Because yeah. the main thing is, like, people, you know, they want to march and do all that kind of stuff. But you got to kind of know, you got to educate yourself on kind of what's going on in the world. 100%. And not ignore it. Correct. Not act like you're not, you're not affected by it. Yeah. All right, so the last one we got is to do with the... Uh, that with his hand on his cheek, he's got you got some wording on the, on each side. Mm -hmm. I can't believe what you say because I see what you do. Yeah, yeah, that's the James Baldwin. Yeah, um, that 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 the picture is actually I'm who trying to find it again. He's trying to find it. 
I'm sorry. I know I know I've seen it several times. There it is right there. Okay, now explain talk to us about this. Um, that's the James Baldwin. Um, yeah. it's a self portrait of James Baldwin. Exactly. Yeah. Um, so he's. Oh, so that's actually him. Okay. Yes, I, okay. It is, okay. That is him. Yeah. Um, you know, he very pretty much advocated mm-hmm. for us as black people. Um, right. as America. Um, he grew up in um Harlem, so he pretty much moved out of America because he was like, we're not being treated fairly in America. So he moved out of America. Right. And right. he pretty much gave speeches on how America treated us as black people. Right. Um, so he pretty much raised that flag of kind of like, this is what's going on. This is how we, we're being treated. Um, so, you know, he pretty much was ahead of his time of saying, you know, this is going on in America. Right. But people are not aware of it. Yeah. Sort of like very similar to how Cap did in football. Okay. You know, he, he kneeled, but of course, you know, it was redirected to saying he's disrespecting America, which it was Or the totally, flag, right. Yeah, which it was totally not what he of was doing or man. representing. But, you know, as a business, the NFL was like, where are we going to push it towards this direction to right. keep, you know, our savior of saying, you know, we're not, yeah. we're not being part of this. So they went totally opposite what, kind of what the NBA did. Yeah. So. And again, you see that picture again on your screen right now. I can't believe what you say. Because I see what you do. I, let me let me ask you a question, just for the people out there. Like, what's what like, like that pain right there? Like, how how much does something like that go for? Depending on the size. Yeah, it depends on the size and time. Okay. Um, I put into a piece. Um, so most of these things you will pay for. Am I right? Correct. Okay. Um, so it it depends on how much time I put in, and sure. you know, you sweat a lot. Yeah. <laughs> you want to see the man with his shirt off sweating? <laughs> no, I'm just saying, Carl Cole was sweating. I'm like, listen, he had that Disney on the ladder, doing it right here. I, I need to so, so some, you know, sometimes you know pieces can be like, you know, I'm working in the background for like a couple of hours, and it's right. working, it's, it's, it's building up. Later. Well, well, let, 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 let's let, let, let's cut the shit. All right, let's cut this shit. <laughs> let's cut right to this shit. Okay, how? What's the most you've been paid for one of these paintings? Would you even like to share that? If you would like to share that. What's the most I've made off a painting? Yeah. yeah. What's the most you've made off any painting? Um, I sold one painting for 800 Okay. No doubt. Cool. So, you know, it, nice. you know, it, all, it all depends on what it is and sure. what that person wants. Yeah. Okay. Um, so if it's, if it's nice. very personal to a person, the person's going to say, you know, I love it. Um, that person may love it and everyone else may hate it. But, right. but it only matters to the person who's yeah, person. Yeah, that's you right. Know, person, you know, because sometimes it's be like it's a, it can be a total personal piece for a person, yeah, right? Um, and they be like, I love it. So like when I did the Patriots, you know, I'm not a Patriots fan, but right. hey, pay me to do it. I did it, so he loved it. So, um, but you know, just different stuff, different scenarios, kind of depends on pricing. So about six fifty for the COVID. I know you love Kobe. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. the boy cried in the shower. Yeah, I ain't yeah, yeah, I'm, a, I'm, but okay. I'm a Kobe. I'm a Kobe fan too. Um, yeah, they think it's funny that he yeah, lost his yeah. life. No, that's, no, that's, no, that's, that's, that's that is not what we think is funny. The funny why, part is why they think that's a joke. The funny part is you sitting there crying back in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> Water running down your butt. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga in that cry. <laughs> I ain't know why I said, Yeah, that's shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm an emotional cat, man. You know, I, I, I was just touched, you know, the man. I can only, because when I see when I see situations happen in real life, man, I just think about me and my family. You know what right. so I'm I think about me and my kids. Like, if I was on the helicopter with my daughter, like, right. I can't imagine what that the, last the second last was like. Se- yeah, last seconds. I can't imagine what it was. It yeah. just hit me in a different way. And Kobe was my childhood. Yeah. Like, Michael Jordan was is, is my guy. Too. Yeah, yeah. Not like, but my like, I grew up with Kobe. When Kobe was 17, 16, right. coming, to, yeah. like, I grew up in his entire career. Yeah. What, what class? We don't give a fuck. I know. Honestly, yeah, he felt like, like Kobe, Kobe felt like sucker. <laughs> like when Kobe, like when Kobe, I, I agree with you, Clarence. Cause when Kobe died, it felt like he was like you knew Kobe. It felt like you knew Kobe. Yeah, so you, you it, it hurt him, bro. Huh. I didn't cry. Did, did you cry? I didn't. I didn't cry. Okay. It did, cool. It did, it did, I should. He it, cried. I should. It did, it, it, he it, cried. It, it, it didn't did affect my day. But I didn't. I didn't have a daughter. But if I had a daughter, it yeah, probably would. I shared a different way. I got two daughters. Cause, I just couldn't imagine. With him, with him going down with his daughter, yeah. it, it probably would. Hit and you knew it was like, like it's quick. You yeah. know it's your last yeah. moments. Like exactly. You, like exactly. It, it hit me different. Yeah, yeah. I, I just, that's like was, that's like watching the movie. Um, and I'm sensitive about my kids. Yeah, I don't you know, know if you saying? guys saw um, was it American Skin? 
Yeah. You know, with the his his kid getting killed. I'm like, they hit me different because I have a son. Yeah, and no it's doubt. Like it, it's, it's a total Nicholas Pitt says Raymond is the best artist. <laughs> I don't so, know who that is, but so so that's a different. Raymond don't know where he got talking to y'all. Mm-hmm. That's that's one of my that's one of my clients. I just want to say, man, like I, I've, been, okay, I've been following your Shout work. Nicholas, I've man. been following, especially your work of late. Like I already knew you had the skills and whatnot, but like what you've been doing lately is super dope. I think it need to be highlighted. That's why you want the show. We want no to doubt. be able to at least, you know, put that, yeah, put that out there. Man. Y'all need to go check him out. Be on the lookout June first, you know, for the for the shop opener. Like I said, I I know I'm gonna be there. I want to be there to support you. Um, you know what I'm saying? And you know, hopefully, I I definitely be along for the ride. And 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 uh, we want to do that because, like I said, what you're doing is dope. And, and his uh, name is on the screen right now. Make sure you go follow my man on Instagram right now, Raymond Garfield. Before we go though, you know, oh. usually we play this game called Deadly Seven. We ain't gonna uh, throw, we ain't gonna throw you. And in I there. think you done had enough tonight. <laughs> yeah, we ain't yeah. gonna throw you. There. Yeah. But like, do you have like, do you have like, maybe you have like a top seven <laughs> or five paintings that you ever done? Like any favorites? Like that was like, man, I really like saw these, and these were like, like. These was dope. Like I done these right here. These are my favorite. Or even that you saw. Like you know what? This was a dope painting. Like paintings I have done. Yeah, yeah. done um, or saw either one. My two favorite paintings I have ever done. I like the the one that we showed tonight with the um, the female and the male with the split down the middle. With so the so the these two. On? Yeah, with the shades. With the shades on. on. Okay. Because yeah, okay. I feel like it delivers a message. It definitely and, does. And most people. Don't see that message yeah, until it's right. yeah. explained to kind yeah. of what they see. It's powerful. And then when they step back, they were like, "Okay, I do see it." Yeah. Um. So you know it. You know, and that was the same time when George Floyd was right. was killed and all that kind of stuff. So it was a lot of emotion poured into. You hear that man cry for his mom? Yeah. And yeah. his mom had been passed away for a couple yeah, years yeah, or whatever. Correct. Like it, it, it was. Just... I only watched it one time, but it was so impactful yeah, no doubt. For, for us to be in quarantine and, and it's broadcasting on all yeah, the networks yeah, of, yeah, of, a, sure. of a male who is sure. killed and then the guy's hands in his pockets and it's like like what is going on right yeah, now yeah, right so you know that kind of thing so it came from a lot of emotion i did that piece those two pieces and the piece with the male and the male holding the female with the flag behind it. I right, did all. Right. I did those three pieces right behind when George Floyd was. Oh wow! Was so me, so you had yeah. emotion built yeah. up in those three yeah, pieces. Yeah. Whatever. So you know when you know I kind of like during that time I was kind of like zoned out. I pretty much freestyled it. I didn't yeah. have it, anything sketched out. Right. I just went to the board wow. and just started throwing paint on the, on the board. Okay. So the um, man so, and the woman holding each other with a flag behind them like yeah. tears of red. Yeah. 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 Okay. So you know during that time it was. It was at a gallery downtown like during the marches when everyone was protesting. The windows got knocked out of the gallery downtown. So we oh did, really? Yeah. Oh so we, right. okay. So yeah. we painted we painted on the boards, and that's that's pretty much what it was painted on. Yeah. Was, okay. Was the, okay. Was the window boards? Um, that's so, dope. Yeah. You know, they asked me to <clears throat> paint. I was like, I did one, and then I was like, well, can I get the other one? And I did the another one. And I was like, well, that was just your emotion, just yeah, kind of running. Yeah. Right. It was it was kind of like third before me at that's the end dope, of the day because right. I was like, that's dope. you know, because during that time I feel like. That America at that time was kind of like divided. Yeah, it, it did, like, and, and it still is kind of. Yeah, it was kind of like it was like. But at that moment, it was like pick a side. Yeah, mm-hmm. at that yeah. moment it was, bro. Yeah. At that moment yeah. it was like pick a side. Cause you was with us. I was with y'all. Yeah, you was with us. I, and to Trump law. Yeah. <laughs> Chad said I'm with y'all. He came over. <laughs> but we're about to go to this. Hey, we're about to go to this. But he came over. He came over willingly. Oh, man. He said, he's like, take me. I, I'm part of the racial draft. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't claim me to the black side. Oh, <laughs> man. I think, I think what you're doing, man, is uh, I, think, I think it's super dope. It man. definitely is. It's super impactful. It need to be highlighted. It need to be brought to the forefront. Because people speak in more than just words. People speak more than just on a platform in front right. of a podium, in front of a mic. You know, and people express themselves in many different ways. And art is something I think is so beautiful because I'm not that talented to be able to do it. But to be you just to told us you could draw. When yeah, I was in the sixth, seventh, eighth, and eighth, eighth, eighth grade, I stopped drawing after the eighth grade. But like, in oh, so seventh, you can't eighth, draw. So you're the trace. <laughs> I learned it though for sure. Like in the seventh, eighth grade, I could draw pretty, but I had to see it. Like if I saw like Spider Man, I could draw it. You know what I'm saying? I went trace and I was I learned how to draw. But but a lot of those because like Doobie and Lance and Thomas, them guys who was All right, next week on the show we got <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, we can be up what he does. Right. But I, uh, nowhere near what I was I any skillful enough to be able to like freestyle or do any of that jazz or paint. No, I, I could never do none of that. It definitely stuff. takes a lot of Like time. I probably couldn't draw now, but I bet you if I picked it up again, I'm sure I would got I, I'm sure something will come back to me. Yeah. 
But what what I, whatever. Yeah. I'm just down, I'm just down to bro, man. Don't hey, don't hate on me, big dog. <laughs> hey, shut no. up and dribble, big dog. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't dribble. I, don't dribble. I don't dribble no more. My key is dude. Uh, <laughs> no, no Raymond, we appreciate you for joining us, bro. I like, appreciate it. No doubt. Being, being, a, being a fan of the show, supporting yeah. us, definitely buying the shot glasses, yeah, man. Definitely has supported us. We got that on IG. We definitely yeah. appreciate you. We appreciate yeah. you, man. Yeah. We, we're gonna highlight you, back. bro. Yeah, yeah. 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 it's yeah. the end yeah. of Black History Month, and hey, hey, and to be honest, you all Black History. I mean, no doubt. What you're no doing doubt. is black history, man. You no are, doubt. You all black history. We appreciate you, bro. We salute you. No doubt. Yeah. You know? Look, the show is brought to you by Gents, Gents by Prestige Barbershop, 4000 Spring Garden Street. Sweet D. Y'all come by and get a haircut. Graysboro. Man. Shout out to Gene Blackman for sure. Appointments, yeah. walk ins. They taking all that, man. These boys tight up here. No, no doubt. And look, make sure you go like. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Go follow up Raymond on IG at Raymond Garfield. Oh, yeah. At Raymond Garfield for sure. Make sure Garfield you follow our... Cat, um, cat Garfield. <laughs> we don't get y'all that, though. <laughs> make sure you hit that subscribe button on our YouTube page. And uh, make sure you... Uh, go follow us on IG. At Boy You Said Something. Raymond, we appreciate it. Fellas, did I say something? Boy, Boy You Said, said something. something. Yo, we out. We out. Glass coming, baby. Boy, you said something. 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 Bo